Hey guys, so welcome to the YouTube channel Let's Crack Neat PG, where you have the top educators, quality content, and you guys are assured a great learning experience. I'm your educator Chaitanya Mittal, and uh, I hope you guys have downloaded the Unacademy Learning app. There are some exciting offers going on with my referral code Chaitanya10, and you guys can utilize this referral code to take a subscription. At the end of this video, I'll be telling you more about the Unacademy program and what are the various batches and the offers that we are running. Okay, so we have an iconic subscription and we have a plus subscription and we have some great offers for both of them. So we have a 12 plus 2 on the plus subscription and also a 3 plus 1 offer. So let's first begin with today's topic and then at the end of today's video, I'll be telling you about all these offers and all about the Unacademy Pro. So today's video, we are doing Renaud Phenomenon. What is the phenomenon? Renaud Phenomenon. Okay. So sometimes you'll also see in books that instead of writing Raynaud phenomenon, they are also writing Raynaud syndrome. So they both essentially mean the same thing, Raynaud phenomenon or Raynaud syndrome. Okay. So chalo, ye dekhte hai. Now you'd be surprised ki kahin ye banda UPSC ki diari to nahi kara Absolutely not. Okay. So I want to not just teach you Raynaud's phenomenon. I want you to remember it and I want you to remember it in a very specific understanding okay so now i'm not i don't want you to remember all these flags what i want you to do is identify what you see identify what you see so you can see in all of these flags there is a concept of red white and blue right rwb red white blue Ye chal hai, right so these flags they are they are having Renaud's phenomenon. Okay, they are having Renaud's phenomenon. Now, why do I say that? Why why am I laying emphasis on this red to white to blue discoloration? Okay, <clears throat> so that is going to give you a, some clues regarding what is happening. So Renaud's phenomenon, if you have a look at it in a very simple form, this is called as Renaud's phenomenon. Okay. <clears throat> in general, if you look at my hand, it's it looks pretty normal. Okay, it looks pretty normal. And if you have a look at these slides, many slides may be isme red, fir white, or fir blue used here. <coughs> so first, I want to put the red, white, blue thing into your head, head related to Renaud's phenomenon. Okay. So as you can see, this hand, you can see here, it has turned whitish. It has turned whitish in color, hasn't it? The hand has turned whitish in color. Okay. So there are these color changes that occur. There are these color changes that occur in the hand, and we'll try to understand why do they occur. We'll try to understand. Why do they occur? So the important thing to understand is that Renaud's phenomenon it involves biphasic changes. Biphasic changes. Kya hota hai? Pehle ek insaan ka ye hai. Let's say this is the hand of that person. Okay. So normally it is sort of reddish. If if there's a decent amount of blood supply, it is kind of reddish. Okay. There is almost it is almost reddish in color. Okay. Then what happens that the distal part of the hand, the distal part of the hand, it starts to become whitish due to vasoconstriction. Due to vasoconstriction, it starts to become whitish. The distal part of the hand. Okay, so let's remove this. And what I'll do is, I'll make the red in the proximal part, somewhere here. Right? And jo baki ka hai, that starts to appear whitish in color. That starts to appear whitish in color. So first of all, there is pallor. There is going to be a development of pallor. Okay. Jab kafi der ke liye ye pallor aise ka aisa hai, what happens? What happens? The peripheral part, the extremities, they start to turn bluish. They start to turn bluish. Okay. So kya ho jata hai basically? Dekho, yaha pe mainly proximally red sa color hoga, which is representing it is okay, decently perfused. And yaha pe thoda sa kahi pe pallor hoga. And then the distal part hai, that will start to turn bluish, indicating cyanosis, indicating cyanosis because there will not oxygen nahi ghi, and then that area will start to turn bluish in color. Okay, so this is over exaggeration, it is not colored. Nahi hota hai. So this is sort of how you are going to identify Reynolds phenomenon. This is also again a very exaggerated image. Okay, so let's try to understand why this happens and how this happens. So again you can see here that there is a redness ki line hai, and uske baad yahan pe, Sub pallor. This is all pallor. This is all pallor. And here you can appreciate maybe a little bit. Here it is bluish. Ho hai. Right? So the hand is starting to turn 
a little bit bluish. So this this is a better appreciation of cyanosis. Ye dekho, ye, ye jo distal bluish ho hai, right? So the understanding is that there is red color in the most proximal part. There is white color in the slightly distal part representing pallor. And eventually there is there is blue color in the most distal part. Most distal matlab yaha pe. Most proximal matlab yaha pe. Beach mein kahi pe white. Right? And this blue color represents cyanosis. This blue color represents cyanosis. Okay. So, ek ye image hai where you can see that this red color, it represents ki yaha pe there is heat. And heat means that the blood flow to this region is intact. Whereas in the extremities, you can see this is turning greenish and towards bluish. Greenish bluish or I, right? So, that means that there is vasoconstriction here and there is not a sufficient amount of blood flow. There is no sufficient amount of blood flow. That is going to happen. Okay. So now, very important to understand a few things related to Reynolds syndrome. Right. So let's try to understand it. So let's try to understand what is exactly happening. Exactly kya ho raha hai pe? Why is this color change happening? Why is uh, there discoloration? Okay. So the primary funda why all of this is happening it's related to vasoconstriction it's related to vasoconstriction okay so vasoconstriction is the main uh, underlying you can say uh, culprit behind everything <clears throat> so in most of the people who have primary nod syndrome i'll tell you what's primary and what's secondary when they go in a cold region or let's say they are emotionally disturbed or there is some emotional response mostly it happens when you go to a very cold region okay and that is why this is often called as cold allergies. Cold allergy. So these people, they are having hypersensitive uh, smooth muscle cells in their vessels. Okay. So these vessels are because vasoconstriction has to occur. So there is very intense vasoconstriction. And it is so much vasoconstriction in the end that the blood, fly, uh, the, the blood supply or the blood flow is completely stopped. And eventually the region starts to turn white. And when there is no oxygen that reaches, the region turns blue. So there is a biphasic change from white to blue uh, on exposure to a stimulus such as cold or an emotional stimulus. All right. So that is Renaud's phenomenon. Now Renaud's phenomenon, I hope you are able to understand what it is, what is the meaning, what is happening. So just try to understand that this was a normal vessel. This was a normal vessel. This normal vessel may vasoconstriction. Hua. Let's say here you had vascular smooth muscle cells. Here you had vascular smooth muscle cells. So the brain through the sympathetic nervous system or the uh, the autonomic nervous system, they asked the cells, they asked the cells to carry out vasoconstriction. Now because these cells, they were overactive, because these cells, they are overactive or the stimulus for vasoconstriction was too intense, what they're going to do is they're going to make this lumen very narrow. Because of this, there is no blood flow. And because of this, all this region starts to turn whitish. It starts to appear whitish in color okay my grace of an arrow but it starts to appear whitish in color and eventually when there is no oxygen when there is no oxygen there is going to be sinuses so that is what is happening there is intense vasoconstriction and because of which you are having these multiple problems okay in the and this is mostly seen in the hands uh that is the arms uh sorry in the extremities of the hands right but you can also find it in the foot in the feet or sometimes in the nose or in the ear or other, other places also okay so Renaud's phenomenon, it is of two types. I'm writing RP for it, primary and secondary. As you know, primary generally means that there is no cause. Okay. And it can occur into three to 5% of the population. All right. And what is happening is the, the differences are important. Okay. This is generally going to happen symmetrically. This is going to happen symmetrically. Matlab left arm may be yoga, right arm may be yoga. Matlab left hand may be yoga, right hand may be yoga. And generally it is not severe. That is, it does not progress. Dhere dhere, now you would wonder ki, what would be the problem to this person. Color is change, ho hai, but that's not the only issue, right? The oxygen is less. So there are there is going to be pain in this region. There is going to be numbness. So therefore, it is a painful condition. It's not like ki, sirf color change or to bande ko kya padega. You're going to experience pain. Alright. So if the involvement is symmetrical and if it's not very severe, it does not progress, it means it is primary Renault syndrome. Secondary Renaud syndrome, it is generally more severe and it is, uh, it indicates an underlying condition. It indica indicates an underlying condition and it is usually asymmetrical. Even primary can be asymmetrical, but usually the secondary one is asymmetrical and it can indicate a range of autoimmune disorders like SLE, right? It can indicate a vasculitis, right? 
it can indicate scleroderma okay so there are a lot of things that can be possible and then it requires further diagnosis so it's a symptom in all of these diseases and uh, to diagnose Renaud's phenomenon there is this algorithm and in medicine you should get used to such algorithms where you follow a sequential order to form a diagnosis for, for, so first you'll ask the person let's say a patient comes to you and you want to tell that whether that person has Renaud's phenomenon or not you'll ask ki kya aapki jo ungliya hai wo zyada hi sensitive hai thand se theek hai ya jab aap thand mein jate hain tab kuch aapko ungliyon mein <coughs> ungliyon mein dard mehsoos hota hai aisa kuch right right if the person says yes then you will try to assess the color changes you try to see uh, whether the white and blue color the red white blue that i have told you that is happening right if that is happening you will try to calculate the score of the disease okay you try to calculate what is what are the stimuli due to which it is occurring is it occurring due to cold is it occurring due to other emotional responses or other any any other factors then you will see if it is symmetrical or asymmetrical then you will see if there is some numbness along with the color change all right then you will see is there a well demar demarcated region of the color change okay and uh, then you will you look at some photographs if the patient has them all right and then you will identify the sites at which this is happening i told you most commonly it is occurring in the hands but it can also occur in the nose the ear the feet and the nipples right it can occur at a lot of places okay and you will identify this triphasic color change finally red white blue okay jaise hi blood supply restore hoti so what is basically happening is when the blood supply gets restored it becomes red again then it becomes white blue and when the blood supply is again restored this is happening so that is the reason why this red white blue flickering i am associating it to renaud's syndrome or renaud's phenomenon so that brings us to an end of our understanding on renaud phenomenon or renaud syndrome thank you so much right so after that i told you at the start that we have a lot of offers going on so the first offer here is on the iconic subscription where if you go for the 3 year plan you can get it for 8500 the 2 year plan is 50000 and the 1 year plan is 40000 only and only with my referral code chatanya 10 please remember to use authentic plus referral codes and if you take the subscription you are not only getting access to one academy but you are also going to get access to prep ladder this is the neat pg iconic subscription all right similarly you can also go ahead and take the plus subscription where you only get an academy but there's a great offer there where you can avail a 3 plus 1 offer that is if you take the 3 month plan you are going to get 1 month free of cost and you can also get a 12 plus 2 offer in this if you take it for 1 year we are going to give you 2 months free of cost we have recently also reduced a 4 year subscription the logic behind that is like for first year me you are going to start with your preparation for second third and at the end of the fourth year you have to give the next examination and as you know very recently the next examination it is in the pipeline of being confirmed we are still waiting an official uh, notification right so you have 4 years so for we have introduced a four year subscription keeping all of this in mind and it's very decently priced if you go for the plus subscription at 60000 and i would say go for the iconic subscription so 75000 and you get not only an academy but you are also getting prep ladder and here if you use my referral code chatanya 10 you will get a further 10% discount on this and that is going to bring your price further down all right we have amazing batches on an academy we started batches for your prof exams also not just neat pg if you want to prepare for your first prof second prof third prof right even for your final prof we have started with batches Besides that, we have started integrated clinical batches based on MCQs, dual educator sessions where we will have integrated sessions. For example, pathology, radiology, and other sessions where you will see that we are going to integrate the subjects, and that is again in accordance with the latest pattern of the next examination that is going to be there for you guys. For the NEET PG, we have a high yield revision batch which is recently started on 30th June, and uh, we have started a batch, uh, another batch for NEET PG on 30th of June. We have batches going on for FMG, INICT, next examination, and we have an MCQ question bank of over thirty-four thousand MCQs for you guys to practice. So what are you waiting for? Just go ahead and download the Unacademy Learning application and kickstart your preparation here, right? And if you do that, if you do that, you have another advantage that when you are taking the plus subscription, in the plus subscription, with the plus subscription, the advantage is you are not only getting access to all the offers, but we are going to give you live classroom courses, which will feel like you are just running a continuous batch. Regular testing in the form of weekly tests and special tests. You will get access to structured courses, unlimited access to live and recorded classes. We have an ask a doubt feature, and you get access to all these features with my plus referral code that is Chetanya Ten, and that is just An Academy Plus. And I would recommend you go for the Iconic subscription where you are not only getting benefits of An Academy Plus, but also for Prep Ladder where you get the recorded video lectures, the updated question bank. We have recently launched Question Bank 3.0 that is there in Prep Ladder, and uh, you will also get handwritten notes here. Okay, so this is the plus subscription. That is everything that is there in An Academy, and this is the iconic subscription. That means not just the best of An Academy, but also Prep Ladder.
ठीक है सो दैट इज गोइंग टू बी इंक्लूडेड एंड फॉर द मंथ ऑफ जुलाई वी आर हैविंग अ मेड माइंड स्कॉलरशिप टेस्ट व्हिच इज ऑन जुलाई 10th टेंथ ऑफ जुलाई इट्स गोइंग टू बी एट एट पी एम ऑन दन अकेडमी एप एंड यू टू यूज माई इन्वाइट कोड चैतन्या टेन फॉर दिस पर्टिकुलर स्कॉलरशिप टेस्ट एंड द टॉपिक हियर इज स्लाइड्स फ्रॉम पैथोलॉजी सो दिस इज स्पेशली यूजफुल फॉर दोस्ट स्टूडेंट्स हुआ इन द सेकेंड ईयर और बियॉन्ड दैट एंड इफ यू कम फर्स्ट You will get a free of cost one year plus subscription. Okay. If you come second to fourth, there's a seventy five percent scholarship. For the fifth to ninth ranks, there's a fifty percent scholarship, and for the tenth to nineteenth ranks, there's a twenty five percent scholarship. So you can take advantage of the scholarship test that is there. And uh, we've launched a new feature for our plus users that is called as raise a hand. So you can basically interact live in the class. You can ask your doubts by raising your hand. You can speak to the educators, and you can clear your doubts much more effectively. That is. That is the best thing that is there right now in the plus subscription. Itna interactive, no other application is going to give you such interactive learning with such quality educators. Okay, so we have a plus course and an iconic course. Like I told you, if you go for the four-year plan and you apply my referral code Chetanya ten, you can get this in fifty-four thousand. And if you go with the iconic subscription, and again, if you apply my referral code here, the four-year plan you can get it for sixty-seven thousand five hundred. So I think this is the best deal for all the students who are in the first year. And if you go ahead with the three-year plan for plus, it is forty-five thousand. For iconic, it is fifty-eight thousand five hundred. Two-year plan thirty-six thousand here, and here it is fifty thousand. And the one-year plan you will get two months extra, and that that will cost you twenty-four thousand seven fifty. Here the one-year plan is for forty thousand five hundred. If you want smaller plans, you can try out plus. And if you go ahead with the three-month plan, you will get one month free of cost, and that is eleven thousand. Always here, remember to use my referral code Chetanya ten. Okay. Kabi kabi kya hota hai that you are not using a referral code that is an educator referral code, and because of that, some of these offers they are not applied. So please always remember to use the right referral code, and uh, that is also a way of telling me that you guys watch this video, and that also inspired you to take a subscription. So thank you so much, guys, for watching. Uh, my name is Chetanya Mittal, and my plus referral code is Chetanya ten. Please remember to hit the like button for this video. Do drop a comment as to what other videos you want, and if you specifically like. Like some part of this video. Do subscribe to our YouTube channel. Let's crack me PG and hit the bell icon for notifications. You can also subscribe to our Telegram. The Telegram channel is t.me/slash/unacademy/neetpgchatanya. Or you can also subscribe to our Telegram channel. Uh, let's crack me PG and that is there in the description itself. Also, I would like to tell you about the Bugs Bounty program. We have introduced this starting from the month of July. So if you can point out any inappropriate content in the videos, right? Be very careful. Any inappropriate content in the videos, you can claim a prize, right? And that is there. uh there's a form in the description using which you can be doing this and that is there to ensure that the quality of your education is controlled by you so do keep that in mind while uh watching the videos so you can take advantage of this as well thank you so much guys